hi everyone in this video i'm going to show you how to create this sticky image scroll effect using framer without writing a single line of code i came across this effect while scrolling a website and found out it really interesting so i thought why not recreate it in framer and i'll leave a link in the description so make sure to check it out i'll also provide a free remix link in the description so feel free to explore that as well I'm Imran from Cycloto and let's get started. First of all, let's create a project. Name anything. I'm naming it Sticky Image Scroll Tutorial. Now click this layers, desktop, click this layout to make it stack and add our text. Let's add a frame by pressing F on your keyboard and change the width to fill we will set the height later name it text also make it stack by click this layout now scroll down and remove the fill color press t on your keyboard to add text and name framer playground change the width to semi bold and text color to this color increase the font size to 45 pixel select this playground and change the font to instrument serif or you can search here and make it fill align it center press t again to add another text Click this font and search for Anton. Increase the font size to 250. Click this text, scroll up and change the direction to vertical. Now click this framework playground, press up arrow on your keyboard. Now let's upload all our images. By the way, you can find all our images in the asset page here on our project. Now select all the images like this and change the width to 350 and add some border areas like 20 and wrap them into another stack by pressing ctrl alter enter or command option return on your keyboard and name it images let's organize all the images in the correct sequence for every two images wrap them in a separate stack this is because as you can see in your project Two images appear in sequence when we scroll. So it's better to group them into individual stacks to have more control over the animation. Select the first and the second and again press Ctrl Alter Enter and name it 1 and change the direction to horizontal. Distribute space between and add some overall padding 20. Do the same for every pair of images. Click this desktop and change the height to fit content. Now click here. Distribute space between. Alright. Now let's make our text sticky. To do that, click on this text and change the height to fit content and click this sticky. But to make a section sticky, we need to set the parent layer's overflow to visible. So the parent layer is desktop and change the overflow to visible. Also add some spacing on the top and bottom. So press F on your keyboard and draw a frame, drag it to the top on here. Make it fill and add some fixed height like 1000 pixel and remove its fill color name it spacer 
press ctrl d on your keyboard to duplicate it and press down arrow on your keyboard like this now let's preview to see if it's working or not yes it's working but the text is at the top so let's move it a bit toward the center of the canvas to do that set the top value to 300 let's preview it one more time perfect it's time to animate our images to animate the image like this we need to select the section in view so click the images this frame scroll down scroll section and name it anything i'm naming it images now click this one and change the height to i guess 900 pixel and align it start next select the image one effect scroll transform section in view select the viewport center select the section images on the form state increase the opacity one scale it one on the two state scale it 1.1 and add a transition now click this two effect scroll transform section in view center images on the form state increase the opacity one scale it 1.3 offset x minus 60 and y 350 now click this two scale it 1.3 and offset minus 60 now let's give it a preview to see how it looks yes it's working but there's a slight issue to fix as you can see the image is behind the text so to make the text appear on top increase the z index to 2 click this image style z index and make it 2 now let's see yes it's now working it's easier to copy this effect and paste it here but since not every image has same position and values so it's better to set each image's animation manually so remove it and click this scroll transform section in view image on the form state increase the opacity 1 scale it 1 and offset x 60 y 60 on the 2 scale it 1.3 60 on each and increase the height to 900 pixel now let's click on this 4 effect transform increase the opacity 1 1 change the offset y 300 and scale it 1 a transition and preview it yes it's working increase the opacity 1 1 on the 2 scale it 1.1 and add a transition increase 1.3 offset x minus minus 60 and y 350 scale it 1.3 and change the offset 
x to 60 increase the height to 900 pixel and align it start same goes to here align it start it's a repetitive process so to keep the video shorter i only showed you the animation for the first six images you can apply the same steps to the rest i'll also provide a free remix link in the description so you can customize it even further my goal was to show you how to create this sticky image animation and i hope you liked the video if you did please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel that's it for now and I'll see you in the next video inshallah.